Yeah, I forgot. You guys forgot about this day. It's Monday, so today is Tech Monday. Today is gonna it's Tech Monday, so time for some tech reviews. Turn the camera over there like that. But hey guys, it's Dale Dorsey back at it again with another video, and today is the second second time doing a Tech Tech Monday video. Um, we had no school today, so basketball games um, Saturday, Sunday, and just finished the last two for the weekend. Um, three day weekend because today is Martin Luther King Jr. Day. So, um, had school off, um, but there was a tournament, tournament that we were doing. So we were like, it was three day weekend for basketball, so. But I'm doing a video because I haven't uploaded in three weeks. And it's time to give you guys some credit. So it's time to give you guys some new videos. Alright, I all just I just bought these, so um actually I gotta go grab something. I'm grabbing. back now. Grab my 3DS. No, well it's a 2DS. But I grabbed it. Let me just take this cartridge out. It's out. Took my game out. So 3DS right here. So now I'll just keep it like that. You guys are wondering why I brought my 3DS because you might be guessing it's probably going to be a 3DS game. And so, here's the first um, tech piece. I have three tech um, pieces I'm going to be reviewing today. Um, one of them is, uh, well, I'm not going to tell you now, but I'll tell you when I get to that. So, we got uh, Super Smash Bros. for the 3DS. Um... One problem with this is, oh, I got something in my tooth. Um, is they don't do 3DSs anymore. It's just this thing, 2DSs now. But good thing what um what Nintendo did is they're compatible with the DS, two 2DS games and 3DS, so you can have all three of those kinds of game like game platforms and you can play it on this one console pretty good console i got it for christmas i really just started using it now because i really couldn't get it set up but same design as the uh actually let me do this i'm gonna do this first time i'm gonna do this right down Like that. So, can move this up a little bit. Or, all right. So this is a 2DS. Um, nothing much. It's the exact same. Put it right here. Exact same setup as the 3DS did. I had the 3DS XL, so that was like the newer 3DS. But it still got Nintendo Cam, Music, Me Maker, Street Plaza, Nintendo eShop, AR Games. They actually brought back Face Riders, so that was a new addition. They got that. I use that. That's downloadable play. 
settings and one other thing with this is that they actually you get a free installed game and then it's Mario Kart 7 so this game is free so if you don't have any 3DS games like if this is your first Nintendo DS console um, don't worry if you don't have like if you do chores and you can only get games from chores um, don't worry there's already one game that you could play on here and it's Mario Kart 7 like like I said they only did um, well, I have Mario Kart 8, Naroma 1, and I have Mario Kart, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe on the Switch. So, I got two Mario Kart games. But yeah, that's all of that. You can get different backgrounds, so you can have background up here and down there. So, but some of them you can get now. And some of them you might have to pay, like, a Pokemon one. On my old, on the 3DS XL I had, I had a, um... Gyarados, I think, on the front. But yeah, that's that. And let me just tr close that for a second. Get this this game out. So I actually wanted to get this game for Christmas, the old one, because I got the new one a couple of week, like two weeks before Christmas. I got the new one, but I also wanted to have one like that I could just use like if I don't have my switch and if I don't have my switch or I don't have my game for um super I uh, was super smash bros ultimate but I don't know have that game in my case and I'm out somewhere and I have my 3DS and I can just play smash um I don't have to play the new one but I can play some kind of smash while I'm out so um I've seen gameplay on this, but this is my first time opening the cartridge. We're gonna use. I don't have scissors with me up here. Wait, wait is there scissors in here? Probably in my side. No, I don't think so. No. Over here. Alright, so I have no scissors, so we're just gonna, oh, my camera battery is, just lost its first percentage, but we're gonna open this right here, right now. We don't need no scissors. Little, if you ever get this game, this is like the last, like, um, this was the last copy at Target when I got it. I just got it, though, but... Sl slap like there's a little mark right there just start pulling that stuff open um i don't know how long they're gonna still have these in this was like the last one i saw at um uh on target but i don't know yeah like i said i don't know how long this is going to be out for so try to get it as quick as you can if you have a nintendo console like that all right, so just opened it, took the paper and stuff off. That's a cool thing right there. Smash Bros. 3D, 3D, Nintendo 3DS. For the Nintendo 3DS, Nintendo. Um, it says play. Oh, so I just explained this, but it also says said it on the bot on the bot on the game card too. Playable in 2D and 3D, 3D mode for ages seven plus. So it's available in 3DS, 2DS, and 3DS 3D mode. So it already says this on the thing. So if you like say, oh no, I have a 2DS, so I can't play this game. Don't worry, you can still play this game on the um on the 2DS. But uh. This, this amiibo thing right here says, like, it doesn't say anything, but it says amiibo, but it, you can use uh, that for, um, you can, I'll show you, but I don't have an amiibo with me anymore, I don't think, but I think is on your 3DS, you put your amiibo that you have for Smash, 
you put it, I think, here or down here. I don't know. Tell me in the comments. And you can, it's, um, uh, what do you call it? Compatible with, um, sma um, Smash, so, yeah. Um, enough talking about what the game is like. This is not the new one, because new one doesn't come out on, in, like, on the DS's, because they're, like, not really, they're not really selling these anymore, but it's a cool back design. Should we that, let you guys read that for a second? Alright, enough talking, because I don't, I only have four hours on this battery. My battery is almost about to die. Well, not almost, but it's losing power. So let's open the game for the first time. <sighs> oh my god. It was super hard to open. So here we get the... Let's talk about the side accessories before we get to the main game. Got this booklet of... This booklet. I'm guessing it opens like. Oh, that's actually cool. So it flips open like this, and it has every single character on it, and it like. Oh, that's cool. It shows um the uh, moves on each player. Sorry, I hit the camera for every single player, so the controls and stuff. So, read this, and you can actually get better at Smash by using this. So that's really cool. I thought it was going to be, like, stuff with, like, troubleshoot. But, here we are. We're on to the main game now. On to the main game. Let's open this right now. There it is, right there. Let's take it out. Just took it out. Keep in the box for a collector's item. But here's the game itself. It's exactly in size like all the other 3DS games. I have one. It's the Avengers. I was playing it a couple years ago. So they're exactly the same. But like different numbers and stuff. But alright. It's time for some gameplay. Uh... Doing some gameplay right now. My brother's also live streaming, so sorry if I'm mm -hmm. like idle for a second there. But it took me a while, but some of the DS games I fit in here didn't work, so let's see if this game works. So the cartridge is below. You guys are watching this video for the first time and knowing that Nintendo still has these things out. We put it through there like that. Upside down. Yep. Works. So, here's Smash right there. I got it right there. And let's actually press play. Let's go. Down to 3DS. I'll really stop talking. Saving data. Don't turn the power off. Okay. Extra data will be created for the software on the SD card. Okay. Alright, let's go. Some music in the background right there. Would you like to activate? No. Your friends can send replays. No. Started playing Super Smash. The duck on stage. Okay. Okay. You got the. Oh yeah. So you can also listen to uh, music while you're on the battlefield. So that's cool too. See, all oh, that's music. So, it's not like, this came out in 2014, but it's not like the music you get, like, when you put it into the Wii U. So, let's put that in. Okay, so we got online, smash, 
Smash, Smash Run, Games and More. Um, you get Solo, Custom, Group, Vault, Options, Vault, Amiibo. Um, so I'm pretty sure this is a classic mode, so we're not going to be doing classic mode. You can connect this to Wii U, Street Pass. Um, we're not going to do that right now. Right now, we're just going to go into Smash. We're going to use Solo Group. It's free for all. You get all the characters, so you really, like, Smash Ultimate, you have to unlock all the characters, but some characters you get free. Um, so I'm actually going to do random. Actually, no. Um, I'm going to do Samus and change the color. They have the color. Yeah. Random. Now we're going ready to fight. So now we're going to fight. And, um, I don't care. Three, two, oh, it's one of these maps where you had to... Oh my gosh, Samus, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, he just lost. He might die, but not. There we go. That's that guy right there. There, right there. Something that's new with this is like your guy actually holds the um. Your guy actually holds the thing you're gonna use. Oh crap! Smash ball. Uh, let me pause it real quick. If you guys don't know what the, if you guys never played Smash before, then the Smash Ball is where you try to, you knock, you try to break it, and once you break it, whoever breaks it and starts glowing, basically, um, gets their super move, and you use your super move and try to see how many people you can get. But, I've just played on this for like the first time, so this is my first time actually playing on Nintendo, um, uh, a DS console, so I just got it. I think it's still the same button. Yeah, it's still the same button, like on the Switch. Just finish that guy. If I just get this guy, Five, four, three, two, one, and that's a dub, and I know it already. Is that a dub? Let's go. First game, and I already got a dub. Winner player one. See, it's not, you get the stats down there. Um, dang, this battery life is almost done. I might have to, might have to resume this on my phone. Um, all right, that was just some gameplay of Smash. We're only on the first thing, so gotta move on. Uh, next um, tech thing we have to review is the new Lego DC Super Villain. Actually, guys, let me go get my camera battery. Getting my camera battery, but uh, check on my brother. He's live streaming right now. He's live streaming, so check out his channel, Isaiah Jr. He's live streaming Fortnite right now. Hold on, where's your camera? Oh, oof. It's delayed on the, um... He's watching it on my Xbox, but it's delayed on my... It's delayed on... It says here, right there. Get out, get out, get out. What's up? Get out. 
Get my camera battery right now. Do it really quick. Cause I don't want this thing dying while we're Alright guys, so I think I'm gonna have to finish this video on my phone because I don't really they're in the middle of talking with my dad. So there's cash money. I'll see you guys in a couple minutes on my phone. So stay tuned. Alright, I'm back. I'm just gonna keep recording on my camera because it has enough battery. I'm just gonna have to do this quick. Um, so here is DC Super, uh, Super, um, Lego DC Super Villains. Um, I don't like, I've actually heard of this game, I just didn't know what it was about. I think it's like, like, I think the villains of DC become heroes to stop the heroes from becoming villains. So, I have no clue what that's about because I've never, I've only heard of the game once. And, alright, but right now it's an Xbox game. So, that's good because I have an Xbox. So, I might be doing a game review on this. But I Get a mic. You have a mic. Yes, but. Um, but. I'm gonna show the gameplay some other time. I'm not, not tonight, because I have to get ready for school. But I'm going to open this. Ah! Why am I talking? But I'm opening this right now. Um. Um, you might need some scissors because they're not really, they're really hard to open these Xbox ones. So, let me just open that real quick. Here we go. Papers off to the side. Here we got the game itself, but... Ah, uh, I gotta deal with this. This part right here. Let me get a pencil or something. Use like a pencil or something to open this. Just put it in. Sorry about the camera, but here we go. Here, get this tape off my finger. Alright, so here we got the. Looks like there's no instructions or anything, it's just a disc. So we're gonna. Oh, <clears throat> this thing's so hard to open. I don't wanna scratch or anything. Here's a disc. Pretty cool disc. Like I said, I'm gonna show you some gameplay later on this, but here's the disc. This is a really good game. You can watch some reviews on it. I think it was a really good game. Um, I haven't played this yet, but yeah, we will be playing this soon. But now, we're on to the big events. Um, I actually have to search up its release date. Okay, so it says its release day was November 10th, 2016, then November 11th, and then it's re- Um, it's really, it was like released in the 1980s, and it, let me see if it has it on box. No, it's someone to invite me.
doesn't say on here, but it was around the 1980s that this system came out. And it was like the biggest system and it was really big. They relaunched it in July of 2018, so about a year ago. Well, technically not about a year ago. It was just 2018, which was just like a couple weeks ago. But it's 2019, so I'm just going to say it was a year ago. So that was a year ago, and um, this is, you guys probably already saw 3,000, like, lots of reviews on this, but I just got it today, so it's going to be my first time opening it, and so. This is the NES Classic Edition. Um, games included Super Mario Bros., Metroid, Pac-Man, Donkey Kong, Zelda, Kirby's Adventure, and many more. Did you get this? They're on the box right Wait, here. What? 30 I never games. Said I never said anything. All three Super Mario games, so. Um, here it is. I'm probably going to show the setup. No, hell. Alright, so. Right now, we are going to open this. You just, it's a flap right here that you open it from. There it is. Put this down real quick. I'm not going to try to destroy the box, but I'm going over here like this so I could see the Switch console. Oh, here it is. Here is the Nintendo Entertainment System. Oh. Here it is right there. Here's the instruction manual. Take that off to the side. Just on the side flap right there. Take that out. Instructions. Instruction manual. Another one. And here we got the NES itself. Take out the side stuff first before the NES. So this is the controller because um, it's upside down right now. Comes in this wrapped thing. Comes in this wrapped part and the what do you call it? The controller like cable. So. Let's take the cable off first. Got that off. Take this off. Wrap. Sorry, I'm not showing you guys. Spin that off. Come off, come off, there we go. Off of that. And now let's get open the controller. There's the controller, guys. That's pretty cool. This controller's really good. Start. So it's got buttons, it's got names. So you got. Sorry, you guys can't see. Well, start and select. Got this pad. This is B. That's A. So it's not like on normal controllers. They weren't. It's not like the PS4, Nintendo, and then Xbox controllers that we have now. So yeah, imagine Dale being here. So yeah, that's the controller right there. Pull this out real quick, and let's pull this cable out. Oh, I bet that I bet that part. Then. I'm not gonna be putting that car part. Move all the rest of the stuff to the sides. Oh, so here we got. It looks like how much charge I have. This camera. No, I'm not going. I'll just use the thing. Here we got the charging cable or.
you're talking to your you so we got the charging cable of some kind right here I don't know what that I don't know what that's for I have to set this up one day um we got got a box right here for I think the other the cable I just pulled out and this right here is probably the HDMI cord. So to plug into your TV for HDMI. Uh, turn, it's like all these other, these zip tie things. There we go, now the HDMI is unlocked. Let's see, HDMI cord. And where do I put it? Oh, there it is. All right. So for actually for the big reveal is the console itself. Take it out of this thing. And here is the NES. Uh, I'm pretty sure here's the power button until you turn it on. See, we s power button is right here. Reset button. Um, I don't think anything else is needed for this. I don't think this part opens, but, yep, that's the NES right there. And, get my camera out. And, that is it for, that is it for my video. Um, uh, that's it for Tech Tuesday. Um, I hope you guys had a great time. I had a great, I had fun time reviewing all this tech. But this is my desk right now from having all this tech stuff now. But yeah, that's all my tech stuff so for Tech Monday. And I'll see you guys later. Bye. Hold on. Try that again. Bye.